going on out there YouTube? This is your host Beastie Boy Drama, and I'm here with a new game, Game Developers Tycoon. Uh, it might not be a new game, but it's a new Let's Play I'm trying out here. This was recommended by Skyrim. It's epic. He said, Beast, you should try this Game Developers Tycoon. It's a Green Hall game. It's a really good game. I've been playing a little bit of man. This is actually a pretty fun game here. I'm gonna uh, show it to y'all real quick. But this is only the light version, as you can see up here in the top left hand corner. Think about it, I'm going ahead and buying the real version of it. The only thing different is uh, in the light version, you only get to play the first three years. And then the game ends after that. But uh, it's alright, though. It's, it's, it's a pretty fun game. Now, as you see right there, my player name is going to be Beastie Boy Drama. My company name is going to be P Town. Let's go. Let me change up my guy, man. I look like that. There we go. All right, all right. That's a little, look more like my nappy hair right there, I think. I like black. I like the word black. Unlock topics. Uh, would you like to? Would you like to unlock previously research topics? Sure. <laughs> oh, I gotta pay for these already. Seriously. No. Oh, these are all my other same ones. All right, we're gonna start off with a new game. Oh, I do have like my other ones. Cool. My first game we're gonna start with is gonna be a, a sports game genre. It's gonna be like an action game platform. I'm gonna put it on the G64 because this one seems to be selling more than the PC. Even though I love the PC, but uh, right now G64. Back in this time of the era right here, G64 was doing it more. My first game is gonna be called Drama Sports. Yes, X. Oh, we gotta have some good graphics. I like graphics. Start development on that. There you go, buddy. Work, work hard. Oh, look at his fingers. His fingers was just moving. Uh, we don't need no story quests in this. We don't need no stories in no uh, sports game. Leave the engine right there. Raise the gameplay level up. Story already down. Let's go. Look at that. Boom, boom, boom. Fingers is working. This guy's not playing no games. Well, actually, he is. Uh, I guess we could put dialogues down. Move all the fish up a little bit in sports. We don't want to have like the game be too easy. Just play like a football or basketball game, the other team don't even move. Like what kind of AI is that? This game sucks. Hopefully we can get like a good uh review off this first game right here, get us going, get us some kind of popularity. Um right now war design is already gotta put the graphics up there. Sound, uh kinda iffy about the sound. Yeah, that's cool right there. Beep boop beep. Ah, oh, we can bugs out the wazoo now. Them bugs came from nowhere. There you go, fixing bugs. I'm gonna add more design to it while you fix it. Cool. Alright, alright, alright. Hopefully, this will be a good one. And uh, this game right here, I got this game off the Windows Store here. I am playing on my Windows 8 computer. And um, it's the light version is free, but the actual game I think costs six ninety nine. I probably will get it buy it later on today or something. Or whenever I put some money on my card, I'm lazy to do it. First reasons came in. Let's check out and see. Uh, six, five, no, six, no, ten. Oh, six. <laughs> it's all right. I mean, it's not the best of the best, but it's the first game though. So. P-Town, a newcomer in the game industry, has just released the first game, Drummer Sports. The game received favorable reviews with such a good stuff. P-Town, this year, game fans quickly. That's lovely. Rising up, rising up, rising up, rising up. Don't lose. But, uh, yeah, that's, uh, we made it to the charge number 62. That's not, no bad, I don't think. Uh, let's see, uh, what can we research here? I don't want to research a game engine yet. Uh, new topic? No, not yet. Right now, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go ahead and try to bang out another new game right behind it. Let's start our start our racing series up here. We're gonna do a uh, simulation racer. Stay with the same platform. Um, uh, let's call this uh, Raceway. Uh, Raceway. XV. Do not ask me what XV means. <laughs> I do not know. Just something random out my head. Yeah, we keep the same stuff. I like the graphics and the sound to be good. Oh yeah. 
listening to my jazz music in the background. Uh, let's drop the energy down a little bit. Have a little bit more gameplay. We don't need no story for racing. This is a racing simulator. Look at that, no bugs. We're doing it right now. 10,000 units So Okay, cool. We got 44, 44k right now. We're not doing to have bad. Right here, let's raise this artificial tendencies up a little bit. We don't need no dialogue, so I don't think. This is that the uh, G64 is daily outsetting competitors in the PC sector. Yes, that's what I expected. Okay, cool. G64 is doing it right now. Alright, right here, we're going to go with uh, a little bit more on the word design. Make it look a little bit better. Sound, not as good. We don't need that much time for racing. Just as long as you can see where you're going, that's all gravy. Alright, we got three books. That's cool. If we can get them three books out of there. Add some more design or something. Anything. Go. Cool. What's the stats? What's the stats? Can't wait to see the review. And basically what you're going to see me doing is when I'm playing this game right here. Uh, after I develop a game, I'm going to be like rat. Like start right back developing another game or either researching something just so I can keep my money flow coming in. Race away XV. Come on. Oh no. Oh. Oh. It's killing me on the reviews, man. Dang it. It's off the market now. It's so it's, it's so dowry. Let's go do another game real quick. Um Let's do, uh, what's this now? Business? Oh, let's do business. <laughs> uh, hold on, let me pick the genre. Uh, make this a strategy game platform right here. And this is gonna be, uh, some type of tycoon game. I do not know. Let's do an RCT. <laughs> Why not? RCT Tycoon. Everybody probably know what that is. Anybody watch my videos anyway probably know what that is. Yeah, cool, cool. Alright, right here, I mean, stories and quests a little bit for the campaign mode, engine, yes, gameplay, great. This is going to be a top seller right here, I got this filler. And we're still making money right there, our voice, Raceway XB. So that's doing it for us right there, look at that, boom, boom, not even, no bugs yet. Alright, uh, I could, I don't even want to throw no dialogue in there, uh, a little bit. Level design all the way up, artificial, probably halfway. We don't need that much AI when you're doing a tycoon game, I don't think. Well, yeah, you do, but I don't know. Right here, we gotta make it sound good. World design is alright. I, I like my graphics up. I like, I like my games to look good. I'll make them. Come on, go, 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 go. Industries. Two rooms that a Japanese copy. Nivento <laughs> is playing and launch his own game console. Nivento is known why for a successful game. Dinky King. Haha. Uh -huh. Alright, alright. Let's see what they deliver. Whatever they put it out there. Which we all probably already know what that is. Oh, got more technology in there. A little bit more technology. Cool. Come on, RCT Tycoon. Do it for me. Be, be my number one seller. Yes, new records. Level up. Come on, need another level up. Probably in graphics. I always love my graphics. Ah, uh, I thought graphics was about level up. Hey, oh, 2D graphics leveled up. That's what I'm talking about. I'll probably hit my level up on the next game. Come on, something good. Hopefully some good reviews. <sighs> oh yes, yeah, seven, seven. That's better than what before. Eight and seven. Okay, okay. That's that's just a hit right there. I knew it. I knew it, man. Everybody loves RTT. Alright, Raceway XV is off the market now. First week, RCT Tycoon. Yes. Yes, RCT Carnival was successful that we we now have 34 fans. Wow. <laughs> 34 fans. Let's see if we can research. Um, am I ready to make a game engine, custom game engine? I think I'm gonna wait. Give me a new topic going on here. Um Let's do sci-fi. Make me a sci-fi game. I don't know what it's gonna be though. Um, I'm about to start looking around in the room for uh, for her names for a game. 
Wow. What is that? That's the TES. Oh my god. It looks looks crazy. Invento TV TES. Oh my god. That's amazing. <laughs> I'm over here just fooling though, but um come on dude, area up. We gotta make some money. Sci-fi, let's roll with it. Pick a topic. Sci-fi, this is gonna be an RPG platform. Continue with the G64. I'm not even gonna mess with the PC now yet till they upgrade their market statuses. Um, a sci-fi game. What do we have here? Um, 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 I don't even know for a sci-fi game. Um, um, I don't even want to, I want to do something original like, uh, uh, Spaceman. <laughs> oh, snap, hold on. Hold on. Uh, yeah, I'm leaving it at Spaceman. Should I leave this stuff up here? Yeah, we're gonna have like the basic sounds and stuff like that. It's, it's not expensive anyway until I start making my own custom game engine. That's probably what I knew next go around. Let's put this right here up since it's an RPG. Put this right here down a little bit. See how this right here turns out for us. Come on, boom, 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 boom. Go, go, go. He's scratching his head. You about to pull all your hair out, dude. Artificial intelligence. We do some dialogues up there. Not that many dialogues, though. Uh, yeah. Cool. So, the 164K? I mean, 167K. I can't even read now. Sucks. That was great, though. Uh oh, something happened. We got bugs out there. We got bugs coming in. Uh, let's drop this sound and graphics down a little bit. Make it a little bit more words out so it looks good when you're playing this game here. Spaceman. Come on, get them books out there. Raise up design or something. The technology is low in this game. That's gonna suck. Level up. Yeah. Alright, alright, alright. Release this game. Come on. I'm good. Oh, that no new platform been released. Oh no. They about to take over. Nimbentu. First release with Spaceman. Come on, something good. Six, seven, six, six. Ah, it's quirky but good. Yeah, I mean it was just some some like off off the back of my mind, like Spaceman one off. Research a controller, that's what I may do. Research a uh, controller, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and research a uh, custom game and then that's what I'm gonna do. Come on, dude. Work. Stop searching your head. What are you doing there? <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, we're gonna research a custom game engine now. This game is just gonna be like bad. It's gonna be like the top notch game engine here. Sale numbers for the Nintendo. Oh my god, Nintendo is like blown up. I would never knew they would blow up like that. Look just like some box or something. I don't know. We had to try that out. Come on, come on. Let's check out the game history while we wait here. Um, so far, my first game was Drummer Sports, which uh was sales rank 62. I re uh review average reviews 5.75. Raceway XV, 49 in the ranks and 5.5 for the score. RCT, Tycoon, sales rank number 19, 7.25. This is our top seller so far. And Spaceman didn't do too much. 92's average score was 6.25. That's what we have so far. And uh, we're going to be making some type of game engine. We're going to make some, some, some cool, some extraordinary. You know what I mean? But uh, we're gonna make this as soon as she's finished this up right here. All right, let's get ready to make this custom game engine. Steering wheel available too, seriously? I may mean, let's go ahead and research that. Why not? I need the steering wheel. Off the market is so okay. I gotta make a new game now. Uh, that game is off the market. I've been doing like a lot of research, and this next game I'm about to come out with is about to be monstrous. Yes. But, um, 
we're gonna do that on the next video. We're gonna make a custom game engine and add some more great stuff to it. This has been your host, Beast Boy Drummer. Catch y'all on the next one. Go.